please note that this is not a kid friendly channel. This channel is for adult collectors, for anime figures, collectibles and various other anime items. Greetings and salutations to you my beautiful nerds, it is I, Richard S. How's it going? I have a lovely video for you today and yes I am still trying to get for my January boxes so I do apologise I am now back at work so finding the time has been a bit tricky for me so yes I know I keep apologising but yeah I have an excuse this time. <laughs> so today's box is brought to you by you may twins and yes this is the January New Year's box so uh, the theme of this is uh, Kawaii New Year uh, I believe that's the theme uh, so it's all things to you know get yourself started for the new year and enjoy yourself and you know get yourself prepped for the new year anyway <laughs> a bit late anyway I know because this is four months behind but let's get through it I roughly know what might be in here because I had some spoilers from a friend on um, on Instagram so I might have some different items I don't know but Let's get this box open because I'm just dying to get through all these boxes and see what we got. So I'll see. First of all, will be our little booklet to explain what we got. So uh, yeah, so the theme of the box is our New Year Home Party 2021. So as we can see, there's some cute animal friends. There's a Shiba, a pug, a wolf girl, and they're all eating New Year foods. They're eating sushi. They're eating rice. There's a, a drama on there. Another thing on the Bucking New Year statue. Uh, there's no face there in the background as well and uh, I believe these are uh, like a traditional cake for New Year's as well with a little specialty orange on it from the region and there's some miso soup so <laughs> I'd love it if there was some miso soup in there but yeah <laughs> not if it was actually made because it would be disgusting now so let's dig in and see what we get so first thing feels like a plushy magnet badge uh, <laughs> okay so this is with oh it's a magnet so it's a magnet right there on the thing and it's of a weird like uh doramon cat with a very piggy nose and beady eyes so i might have to stick this on the fridge and freak my mum out <laughs> it's really cute though because it's actually really well stitched and it's nice and squishy i had a magnet like this before from uh Rilakuma. so i'm not sure if it's just this one or if there's lots of different ones i have to refer to the book uh so this is from the uh drama push plushy magnet series so uh drama are a japanese tradition at new year symbolizing good luck and fresh starts to keep the soft miniature plush on your fridge as a daily reminder to keep your goals and dreams for 2021 with several designs of a shiba black shiba bay shiba bulldog white cat black cat sparrow or white sparrow so yay I got white cat so <laughs> hopefully it will bring me some luck and yeah fingers crossed bring me some fortune because I could really deal with it this year with a, after being on furlough pay for god knows how long I could do with some more money <laughs> right so let's crack on so it feels like I've got another set of chopsticks and oh okay so that's why no face was on the cover we have a set of spirited away no face chopsticks and he's holding the bath tokens that he gives to send in the movie so i've now got two pairs of totoro chopsticks two pairs of gg chopsticks so now i just need a matching pair of another spirited away set so these are really cool they'll go with my set so when i eventually move in with a place for my partner we can have a huge japanese banquet and i've got plenty of chopsticks to keep everyone happy so <laughs> i actually really love those because screwed away was the first anime film i ever saw at the cinema and yeah changed my mind it freaked me out when i first saw it and then when i constantly watched it again and again and again i appreciated it a lot more and i loved it if it weren't for toonami advertising it i would have never gone to have seen it so yeah it's still one of my favorite films so awesome uh so these are the uh, Ghibli No Face Chopsticks. So we all know that No Face from Ghibli Spirit Away loves to eat. Start the new year off with a proper feast with these solid bamboo chopsticks. Your ideal partner for your Shiba chopstick rest. Oh, okay. I think we've got that in the box. Uh, with shallow indents in the tip to keep food from slipping. So, yay. Really cool. Loves me some chopsticks. So obviously we must have something to enjoy some food because I can feel a bowl and a big plate so i'm not sure if they go together so okay we have a little black bowl next and it says i am a yummy dog on it <laughs> randomly so a little black shiva face so yay and on the other side it says that was yummy and it has a dog bowl with biscuits so 
is this meant to be for a dog? <laughs> Can I give my food to Cookie in this? I don't know. I need to see if the plate's matching. Ah, yes, the plate is matching. Uh, and it says, uh, I will stay with you on the bowl. And again, there's another Shiba face and another dog bowl. It's got, it's plastic, but it's got like a wood texture on it, which looks really nice. So, okay, that's really cool. So they go together. So you've got your, your little bowl. So you can rest your chopsticks on the side and you've got to worry about getting noodle broth on there so that's really cool so yeah yeah another another piece of crockery to go with the collection it's not really crockery it's plasticky but <laughs> tupperware there you go uh so this is the shiba bowl so enjoy your shiba bowl with you at every meal great for rice soup cereal yogurt ice cream and snacks dishwasher safe but do not use in the microwave with three colors of black red or brown i would have liked red but no, i don't mind black too much it's a nice smart color and the plate was separate, I thought these were together and this is the Shiba serving tray uh, so better than a regular plate, the sighting straight raised edges lead themselves to snacking in front of the TV anytime you're ready to relax or eat outside the dining room with a half moon shape you can decorate your favourite trinkets or fruit with a tasteful centrepiece and use this for leftovers as well okay, I prefer it to go with the bowl personally because it matches but hey, yeah, it's for everyone their own so that's two items in, in one i guess <laughs> right so i'm trying to dig around for the little things because there's a massive plushie in here and i just saw a big glance of yellow so oh here's our chopstick holder so it's a little ceramic shiba dog and i think he's got a little little uh, knapsack on his back so let's have a look and take him out the packet so we can see him there oh this is actually really sweet so here's our little shiba so he's got a really cute glaze on him he's a little tan shiba with a white face and he's got a little square sorry little triangle fabric on the back and yeah you just rest your chopsticks on him so you don't get the table messy so that's really cute i haven't actually got any chopstick holders so this will be my first one so yeah really cute so uh this is the uh shiba chopstick rest so your first item in the dining room set will be brightening up your tabletop for the year with a porcelain shiba buddy good for forks spoons knives as well as chopsticks and after dinner is done display in the kitchen as a decoration comes in black or brown shiba so i got the brown shiba which i love because yeah they are so cute little doges so really awesome so <sighs> Our last item is a plush and I can feel the shape and I really hope it's that little favourite little custard pudding. So I'm going to raise the camera so ah, yay! I got another pom pom pudding. You know I lost my pom pom pudding. <laughs> oh my god this is really cute. Oh so it's a New Year's plushie. So um, as you can see he's got a little fan with some cherry blossoms on and he's got I think these are leaves. I'm not sure what this is meant to symbolise. I don't know but I'll probably say in the booklet oh my god this is literally the squishiest plush ever I've had of a pom pom pudding. So I don't know if it's meant to be a cushion or if it's meant to be a plushie but I'll, I'll put it in my plushie collection <laughs> anyway uh so this is the uma twins exclusive ooh, pom pom pudding new year's plushie so this year i can't talk this yummy twins exclusive for japanese new year's is soft and huggable pom pom pudding is decked out with a hagata paddle in his hand and a hane at his side which are used to play a traditional badminton like game to ward off evil spirits oh okay i thought it was a fan it was it was a it's a badminton racket uh, one of the finding characteristics of this plushie is how perfectly round it is, making it extra cute for your space. Oh, okay, so that's like the shuttlecock and that's the badminton mat. Okay, I learned something new. Okay, thank you, Yumi Twins. I learned something new from Japanese culture I didn't know about. I thought there were, I thought there were leaves <laughs> around them. But yay, this is definitely my favourite item of the box. So guys, that was everything in the January box. That was short and sweet, I gotta tell you. But some amazing items. So just to quickly review, guys, we had the weird uh, Dramon cat magnet. We had the no face chopsticks. We had the little snack plate serving dips tray and the batching bowl. We had the ceramic Shiba chopstick buddy and the really cute new year's pom pom pudding plush so guys what was your favorite item in this month's box leave your comments down below and if you like this video give it a big old thumbs up and please share my videos with others who might be interested in it i appreciate any new people coming onto my channel so 
anyway guys until my next box figure or manga review i'm gonna say sayonara stay nerdy stay happy and wear a mask and keep safe my peeps